I'm sure they'll have uh, fresh memories and to be looking to put that defeat behind them and get three points here to try and uh, get a little bit closer uh, to that chasing pack of the top five of the NPL New South Wales. Found themselves at the wrong end of a shellacking by a red hot Sydney FC side uh, last week. Going down by six goals to two. A bit of space here for Dira Billard who skips past quite Mallet and then swings the ball in. It was always going to go wide. That's fine. Bounces away on the edge of the air. Simonovsky sets up Quat Mallet here. He's maybe a bit too wide. He has a, sh uh, a shot at goal. Leroy Jennings with it. Curls it in. Littler was up there. He got ahead to it. Deflected and then pushed back across the face. A goal into the back of the net for Wollongong. I think it's Peter Simonovsky who's got to the scraps. There wasn't really a whole lot going on for Wollongong. Nicholas Littler getting the first touch. And glancing across the face of goal, and Simonovsky there just to drive home from a few yards away. But great going forward, the Wolves, but defensively, much like they did last week, are looking fragile as two Ray pulls one out of the top draw and levels for Northbridge. That was wonderfully done by the hard working striker, Al Hassan Toure. He got a little bit of a sniff of an opportunity. And he latched onto it. Some uh, great uh, opportunities taken by them as now Jed Drew tries to get in behind. He skips past one defender. Jed Drew pulls it back to the middle. Probably should have taken it himself. Rose denied. Lashed by De Rabillard. And Northbridge have two. Gee, they made hard work of it. But they eventually were able to bury the ball into the back of the net after a myriad of opportunities. Started by Jed Drew, which who probably, to be fair, could have taken a shot on himself. Now it goes to Jed Drew, who's got plenty of space and time. Here he might fancy him set chances. It's knocked away. And thankfully for Wollongong, Hayden Juros came to the party there because they were parted like the Red Sea. Swung in. Little got up for it. There is a head, and it's a goal for Wollongong. Lovely done at the end. And it's Banri Kanyazumi who was powered at home from just inside the area. And Wollongong, after pressing for this second goal, have been rewarded. Nonchalant celebrations, it must be said. And we're locked up at two all against the Sutherland Sharks a few seasons ago that made headlines in the footballing world. Jennings with a looping ball to the back post, headed back goal bound, and it almost found its way in. Hard to take on Sujimura. Links up with Jedru again, who finds Alhassan Toure. Look, this is going to stay a bit wide. Give him a little bit of room and space. And then Toure gets on the other side and pulls it back. There's almost a third. There is a third. <laughs> Wollongong have just been calamitous at the back this evening. And Lachlan Rose jogging on the spot to bury home his fourth goal in just his third appearance. But put it down to Al Hassan Toure. Now Lachlan, not Lachlan Scott, it's Leroy Jennings. And Leroy Jennings thought about pulling the trigger. He goes across field. Still going as Leroy Jennings. And sends it just wide, but that's promising. So a free kick about 25 yards out. It's a great attacking opportunity here as Jed Drew stands over it. Curls the ball in. Free header. And a wonderful save by Duros. That is a classical save. But now we'll balloon out on that left midfield for Rose. And Rose with an effort from outside the area man back at the moment. All hands on deck. Coming out with Suman who doesn't get a clean catch on it and he's out of the area. Dangerous. They might have a, a chance. Everyone's saying to go for a crack. It comes in for Lilla. Lilla heads off the crossbar and bounces away. Handball is the appeal from Wollongong. Barely touched the ball the last 10 minutes and now it's breaking nicely for Diego Benilla who still has got the ball. Benilla inside the area. Diego Benilla and Hits it hard and hits it firm, but hits it high and wide. Something to perhaps go their way if they're to get out of jail here. Benilla skips past one defender and then links up nicely with Kokowski. Kokowski! Just wide again. Again, it takes a deflection off some desperate Wollongong defending.
And there it is, full time. And for the first time in nine league matches in the NPL New South Wales, the Northbridge Bulls celebrate victory and they've done it in stylish fashion, upsetting the Wollongong Wolves down here on the south coast by three goals to two.